here's Brody Brazil. This is my product review of the Weller WE1010NA digital soldering station, which I've had now for a couple years, but only in the past 12 months have I really put it to use on a frequent and regular basis. And because of that, I guess I've just got a brand new appreciation for this product. Like I knew when I got it back then, it would stand the test of time. It was built well. It was something that I would enjoy using, and I do, but now actually putting it to the test on a regular basis, it just makes me want to make this video to share with you in case you're looking for a new soldering station like this might be the one that you want to get. First things first, and yeah, number one, if you couldn't tell, it's a treat to use. It does a job, and it does it really, really well. It's ergonomic. It's simple. It's efficient. Yeah, reliability is on here too, and that's very important to me. But I think it goes to my next point here, brand quality. When you're looking for a soldering product and you see the brand Weller, like you know you're getting professional caliber performance here. Even if you're only somebody like me who's doing amateur, <laughs> sometimes caliber work, uh, you just know that you are overdoing it in terms of tools for the job. You know you're getting something that's capable way more than you are. And for me, that's a great thing. So brand quality, it's built like a tank. I know that's a common saying when people do reviews, but this thing literally is. It's going to outwork me and <laughs> it might actually outlive me too. We'll, we'll find out, but I wouldn't be surprised if it does or it did. And yeah, a large part of all this is reliability, right? You turn it on, it heats up, it does so quickly. Um, this device is built for the long run and it's built for, yeah, everyday use, even if that is not your intent. So I have to say, in terms of big picture thoughts about the product, they are all tremendous. In terms of the specs, this is a 70 watt soldering iron. The base unit is about six inches by about five inches by about four inches high. So fits well on your bench, doesn't take up a ton of space. Obviously you'll have the soldering rest in there too, where you rest the pencil, rest the iron. Um, but in terms of the base unit, doesn't take up a lot of space. It's not gonna fight the rest of your bench for real estate, that's good. And in terms of temperature ranges, 200 to 850 Fahrenheit and 100 to 450 in terms of Celsius. Let's talk about what this package comes with. Three main things. Number one, the power unit. That's what you're seeing there on the screen. The WE1 is the model specifically of that. The soldering pencil or iron is the WEP70. By the way, that fits so well in the hand. Like the shape, the size, the weight, like the foam touch. You, you don't realize really until you start soldering a lot how important having a good pen is not just the iron like if it was a big iron but having just a very precise and accurate pen really helps you get into all the smallest spaces and work efficiently and and specifically and then you also get the safety rest which is the ph 70 i like this because it has a ton of weight to it you're not going to tip it over easily it doesn't sit up too high it's nice and low and big target right sometimes you're distracted when you're putting that soldering iron back in its rest and the ph70 it does a simple job it does one thing and like everything else here it does it well how about my favorite features of this weller soldering station i really like the large lcd display and sometimes just to double check what did i set the temperature at and where is it currently is it going into standby mode uh, the menu system, which is easy, I'll describe in, in just a second. It's all easily understood and readable. It's simple to comprehend, you know, from even half a room away. Um, and I think, again, this is a product that basically just does one thing. It gets hot. It does more than that. It does it in a bunch of different ways, but um, you don't want to have too much information on the display here. So it it gives you what you need and only what you need and does it in easily digestible fashion. I also really love the quick startup. I mean, watch this. You turn it on and that temperature within about 30 to 45 seconds, I would estimate, uh, for me goes from zero to, I don't know, about 320 degrees Celsius. It gets there 
quick, does not waste a lot of time. Like, granted, I, I would be patient if I had to, but I don't have to. And in fact, I think I'm getting spoiled <laughs> by something like this soldering iron. It should take a while to go from zero to 320 degrees, but it does it safely, obviously. It just gets there quick. So if you need to shut it off for a bit, or if you need to take a rest from your work and then come back to it, no problem in getting it right back to an operating temperature of your desire. The menu's easy. Dialing in, dialing in the precise temperature you want, very simple. Uh, dealing with the standby power timing, very simple to set up. There's also a lock you can put on this unit so that nobody else can alter the temperature or settings beside you. That's a great feature, but all of this is easily understood. Like there's four options in the menu. That's it. You don't need much more than that. And the other thing I like about this Weller soldering station is specifically with the pencil. You can change the tips. And it's not just in case you oxidize and destroy a soldering tip, like that could happen, but it's the fact that you can pick out your custom tip, whether you want something pointy or flat or knife shaped or screwdriver shaped. It's just, it gives you all of the size options you could ever want. Uh, replacing a tip is pretty easy. You just screw off the end, slide out the tip, put a new one in, slide the cap back on, screw it in, and you're all done. So, you know, unlike cheaper options, which would not give you this flexibility, different soldering irons don't give you that choice. Like you're stuck with the tip you got. Uh, for this one to have replaceable tips, it obviously length lengthens the life, the service life of this soldering station, but it also makes your job so much easier if you're trying to do something specific. So that's the Weller WE1010NA digital soldering station. Again, um, I recommend it. I realize that price point, it might be twice as much as other things you'll see out there. But think about this. In the long run, this is a buy it for life type device. You're going to have this. You're going to use it for a long time. Wouldn't you rather have something for the next 10, 20, 30 years that's going to serve you better and help you perform better over that span? Because in the time that you buy this and have it for 30 years, you might buy two or three or four cheaper soldering irons that all poop out over time. So why not just get this, the big dog, do it right do it once and do it for a very long time. I highly recommend the Weller WE-1010NA.